All right, crowd getting excited as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five to a point. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the champion. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Lee gets caught with that punch. Nice leg kick, kick lands. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. He is all about that left kick to the body. Oh, damage done. Bleeding from his cheek now. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. Oh, massive knee to the head. We'll see if he can follow up. Big kick. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Thomas Almeida. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Looking to land the right just out of range. And then take shot. Now, take shot. Head kick attempt, but the fighter got the right hand up. Liver kick. Ooh, nice, nice right hand. He's throwing every part of himself. Big leg kick. Nice punch there by a defensive Almeida. Able to check that kick as well. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Almeida gets touched by that kick there. Oh, nice knee to the body. Strong to quite strong there. Oh, single collar tie here. Switch knee lands to the body. Lands a punch. Oh, that's a good right hand. Hard shots landing on both sides here. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Under two minutes to go. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Lee gets caught with that punch. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Try to establish that jab. Oh, he tagged him with the punch there, DC. That's an educated left hand. He's got great timing with his left hand. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Lee's cut is over. Making a nice donation to the canvas tonight. Oh, collar tie. And now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch, and I think a lot of people watching wonder how you can control an opponent like that. Hard to get out of. It's very difficult to get out of. Look and notice how tight his elbows are as he's maneuvering and moving his opponent in the position where he can get off the strikes. Clinch with the right hand. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Back to the clinch. Oh, beautiful knees in the clinch here. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Man, that hurts to watch as he lands another strike to his opponent's liver. He has continued to target that area after landing that huge liver shot earlier in the fight. He loaded up there with that high kick. 
What a round. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, second round is getting yeah, underway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always going to be. When you have two very talented fighters, sometimes it's very easy. That's what we saw in round number one. Look at how his turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Body kick is blocked. There by Almeida. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Caught the kick. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very fast. Effective punch there by Lee. Nice head kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. All right, he'll engage in a single power tie. The transition, nice scramble. Oh, he stunned him with that knee to the head. Lands a good combination. And he continues to work the body here. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Almeida gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Can't take many of those, you better check. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Back to the jab now, no good. What a body kick. Oh, he dove and he lands. Wow. Pretty significant left to the left side. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Pretty good ground and pound by him here. He told us on Thursday he needed to be more effective in these situations. Certainly effective tonight. Many people have gone away from this style of fighting. This man has embraced it, and you are seeing why he's one of the best that we've seen do it in a long time. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. When you're in a clinch, you can pull down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that. Whoa! Oh, him up. Go get him. Oh, how about it? Left up and delivered the diving punch to the head. Lee's looking to go from the full to the half guard here. Opponent not having it. Gets up again here, but Burton. Nice punch by Thomas Almeida. Closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. 
Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Almeida gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Plans the right hand. Whoa! So far. All right, that's the end of the round. He's got a cut on his cheek from that round. There are certainly worse locations for a cut on the cheek. It's not going to trickle down into the eye. Nonetheless, pretty significant gash. We'll see if the cut man can close it up. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Big punch land. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Almeida going for the leg kick. He does not connect. signs of swell. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. That one appeared to stun him. has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing it. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Oh, he's got him in a crucifix now, DC. We've seen you go to this a couple times, no? This is one of my favorite techniques. I got Vulcan Ozdemir here, and I just landed punch after punch after punch. They didn't have to be hard, but if you can land 30, 40 strikes in a row, the referee will have no choice but to finish the fight. All right, less than three minutes to go now in round three. And we have passed the midpoint of the fight. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Dig and kick. And they separate. Just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta is going to stop in this contest at 2 minutes, 55 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce.
the Dragon Lee. Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out cold. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout.